before this whole place floods or comes down. The place is exploding. Rocks are falling everywhere and you're taking the elevator. What if the power went out? You'd be trapped. suffocate in this room, but you still need to find a way to get to the transition seal. I is there anything you can use to put out the fire or something? Whoa! No, don't do that! You will bring the place down in your head? I, I can't believe that worked. Oh, oh, right, get going, before something else happens. Wow, if you'd been there a few seconds earlier, you'd have been incinerated. Thank the maker you were, though. <sighs> I need the muscle. Blue, the floodgates opened up wide. Toxic goose rising fast. The sensors maxed out ages ago. Warning lights woo, going crazy all around. This just got a lot more serious. All right, you're at quality control center 95D. Hold a bit further and you'll have to hatch up to me. Hurry. I'll try to slow the goo down a bit. Another blocked corridor. So, Mel, why don't you take your time? Look around here. I'll try to slow the rising goo down a little bit harder, I guess. Just don't take all day. are locked. Uh, back in the day, the wiring was a bit strange sometimes. Try turning some machinery on, see if that also unlocks the doors. Wow, th that, that actually worked. Uh, I mean, great. Well, that's just great. Can't we get through a room once without stuff blowing up or blocking our way? Uh, try to find some water again or something. Great. From there, there's just the vault. Don't get comfy, though. I pulled the plug on some emergency runoff dams, but the goo is still rising. Wow! This place is massive! Whoever built this place must be a great architect. Up high, at the back side of this room, is a control panel. It controls the hatch. Try to get there.
records show that at least two people were needed to activate the vault hatch. You are one person. There's a bit of a problem there. I'm sure we can figure something out. Anymore. That's definitely a plus. 